how were you able to, to bear down and give them seven? <clears throat> yeah, um, definitely not the start that we wanted and putting our guys in a hole early against a guy like Reeves, definitely not ideal, but that's a tough lineup. So I honestly didn't really have my eyes set on a certain amount of pitches or innings. I was just kind of taking it one hitter at a time. And, you know, I wanted to put my foot down and give us a chance to claw back into that game. Um, and then I think we had one, maybe it was like the fifth inning was a six pitch inning. And that kind of allowed us to get back on track pitch count wise. Um, but, you know, with a bit of a short bullpen to be able to, to go seven, um, you know, that's one of the only good things to come out of today for me. You mentioned the pitch count. I think you threw 26 pitches there in that first inning, a little bit of a longer second inning as well. How were you able to become pitch efficient throughout the rest of it? Um, yeah, I mean, we threw some fastballs, um, even in, in fastball counts, like maybe where they knew it was coming, and I just executed to the right area, to the right spot, um, and was able to get some quick outs. You know, 0-0, 1-0, 0-1. Um, we kind of stopped nibbling. We weren't too cute with it. We just kind of started attacking and that got us in a nice rhythm and flow um but yeah I mean it's one of those things like I, w I didn't have my eyes set on necessarily just trying to be super super efficient I just wanted to get each hitter out one at a time and it just so happened that you know a few of them swung early and we we got the pitch count on track knowing that that team likes to, to hit fastballs and they could do damage just how difficult is it navigating through that lineup multiple times yeah that's got to be one of the the best lineups in baseball um you know they off me out there they hit a slider in the first inning then a up and away 3-2 curveball one of them pulled it the other one hit it the other way that's a good example kind of they can cover a few different things you know throughout the whole lineup they can do a lot of different things well uh they're aggressive but they don't swing and miss a ton they don't chase a ton you know they're pretty professional so uh that's a tough lineup but you know it's one of those things you still have to attack them you can't fall behind them stuff like that but uh yeah they're they're definitely a tough group um but i'm looking forward to seeing what we can do the rest of the series bob clapish you have the next question jameson you you did your part today but you guys are really struggling now with uh, less than a month ago what what is going on with this team in your opinion yeah i mean it felt like for a little while there we really couldn't lose if we tried. It seemed like everything we did was the right move, or you know, we were putting together great at, great at bats against tough pitchers. Or our starters were going out and doing their job, passing that on to the bullpen. And now it's kind of just feeling like maybe one day we'll hit a bunch, and then we won't pull our weight. And then you know, on the starting side, and then flip that. Um, you know, it, it's one of those things that to win, you all need to be you know, pulling your weight at the same time together, pulling on the rope in the same direction and stuff like that. But obviously, you know, the guys are, are working. Um, you know, I can definitely guarantee you that. Guys are putting in the work. Um, it's not fun losing, you know, that's for sure. Um, but we still have, what, 25, 30 games left. I think we can put together a nice, nice good streak here. Um, and that can start tomorrow. We've got Garrett Cole on the mound. I mean, that's a great place to start.